What is up, fishers and foragers? I actually made a road trip out yesterday with uh, my Donnie, who you've seen before. And we actually have a guide for this particular place. I'm actually on the Quinault Reservation with Nate with Savage Fishing Guides. So if, you, uh, if you're ever interested, this guy can take you out on the reservation to all those spots that uh, you can't normally get to yeah. without him. I'll go ahead and link his his page in the description and you can go give him a call, give him an email and Anytime. set up set up your own trip to come out here and hopefully catch a bunch. I mean, that's what we're hoping to do today. Oh yeah. Catch a ton of fish yeah, on this we're river. Already seeing him jump in. Yeah, they're we already seen him jump in. I got so on my setup, I got a, just a regular float setup, uh, eighth ounce quarter ounce bobber, quarter ounce bobber weight. I got my salmon row from last year, which should be fine. Um, I think Donnie and Nate are gonna use these guys which are like they're kind of custom spinners but they look gnarly they look they good work great. Cu uh, custom wickeds custom yeah. wickeds yeah. so yeah they and they they work tremendous uh a lot of times mostly with this upper river they like going after blue sometimes chartreuse nice uh, but they're just you know, we're uh, like we're uh, like i was telling you we're only like a I mile and a half from really close the to mouth. the ocean yeah, yeah. so nice. they're still they're still after that squid looking type yeah. and that type of bait but and even floating eggs works really well just that now uh, that natural flow here and oh there's another one jumping right there too oh my uh, god i think it, it's going it's going all right to be yeah a good one. we got to get out here guys let's let's get on the water and catch some fish oh, take yeah. you along with us stick with us stay tuned and let's do this Here, fishy, 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 fishy. You want fish on? Yep. Damn, look at that. I'll get the net just in case. <laughs> first fish of the day. That was like what, your first cast? Oh, did he pop off? Nice. Is it a good one? And put the rod down. Oh, yeah. Nate is on. Ooh! Peeling line. <laughs> now I gotta switch that spinner, man. Yeah. Those wickets work really good. Thank you. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, you did. I, I grabbed your pink one. Yeah, Donnie the man over there, he's the one who made all those, so. My first time making them. He's like half your fish, right? <laughs> Let's go. Ooh, it's pretty. See him flash. Oh, you're not going to grab the net? He no. didn't want the net. Grab the net. No. <laughs> grab the net. We'll see who wins this argument when it pops off on the shore. Or... It's got a good hook, though, so I'm hoping that yeah. it should, should hold well. Yeah. I mean, he's jumped a couple oh, times. Like a jack. That's okay. That's still good. That's a pretty fish. Look at that. Oh, that's a nice looking fish. That's definitely a jack. You know, jack banking him? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, it's a, oh, it's a nook. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that fish. You got him? Oh, I got him. Woo! Actually, that hook set's not that good. Right yeah, in the oh, nose. Right through his beak, yeah, actually. that's perfect. Ah. Yeah, that's a jack, but that's a... Well, Let's I'm go. I'm sure it's a jack. We should measure that. Yeah, we should yeah, definitely measure that. Measure yeah, but either way, he's fat, though. Nice and fat. So yeah, that's yeah. a healthy looking fish. Dude, who has a measuring tape? Uh... I think I might. Ooh, there's uh, more. Let's go, guys. Fish on already. Hey, look. It's almost like I'm prepared or something. On the reservation, you can keep unclipped fish. Down in the comments, I don't want to hear anyone talking about it being yeah. native because we're on a river where you can keep them. <laughs> well, he's 25, so no, he's that's, a, that's, an adult. that's an adult. Yeah. It's a nice one. Let's go. All right, I'll put a spinner on. It's fine. I have no, two. No, you can get floating, man. I got two rods, so I could just pop a spinner on whenever I want. Whew, look at that! Already got a fish. That's awesome. 
I'm super stoked. Pretty little, pretty little nook. All right. Oh, it works pretty good too. Give her a shot. This is the Donnie special. We got this sliding weight on here with a nice long leader to this. What's it called again? The Wicked. The Wicked? I call him Wicked. Like wicked Lure. Wicked Lure. Basically. This almost looks like a trolling lure. Sorry. Well, catching one in like 10 minutes was uh, a good sign. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A marathon. Oh! Holy shit, you just walked down from there, Donnie. I know. I'm so Oh, fish on! Woo! <laughs> Let's go. I think he's a jack. Yeah. Yep. Little guy. He's a shiny guy, though. He's pretty. Yeah, I can just bank him. Come here, buddy. Gonna bank himself. Yeah. Yeah, he might. Yeah, he's pretty short. Ooh, look how shiny he is, though. That is a gorgeous fish. Wow. I thought yours was shiny. Beautiful fish. Oh yeah. Gorgeous. Look at that sea lice and everything. Oh yeah. Fresh from the ocean. Goodbye, bud. Let's go! <laughs> oh, I'm so excited, man. I haven't caught a salmon in like a year. Well, no, like nine months. Dude, it's beautiful fish. Look at that for the camera. Look at that mirror, mirror fish. That's a gorgeous little fish. I was thinking about picking stuff up and moving down. There's a, ni there's a really nice hole right around the bend. I saw one jump. Not that, like, jumping fish are biting or anything, but... Fish on. Oh yeah, that's a bigger one too. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Oh yeah, this is a nice, oh wow. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> He's giving us a show. Dang. Come here, buddy. Yeah, he is not, he's not giving me an inch. Stay out of those rocks. And walk down. Come here, bud. Oh crap, he's around that rock. Oh, he's it, got him, got him. What is he doing? I think he's still around that rock. Shit, I think he's around that rock. Oh, he's moving up. Thanks, bud. Thanks, man. I'm gonna try to pull him back, get him away from there. Come here, bud. Yeah, just wanna get, keep him away from those boulders. Holy cow, that's a big fish. <laughs> Oh, he's turning, he's turning. Here he comes. Give me, bud. Oh, nope, he's not done yet. 
Yeah, he's definitely t tuckering out. <laughs> you done? Oh, here he comes, here he comes. Let's go, let's go. Oh, he just popped off. Oh my God. <laughs> that was like two feet away from the net. That was a nice one, man. I didn't want to jump into it. Yeah. I would have spooked him and you would have. Man. He really would have got irritated. <sighs> That's painful. That was a good one. That was the one I was looking for. Dang it. <laughs> That's a good fight though. Yeah. He jumped all the way out of the water. That was nuts. Oh, I'm heartbroken. Yeah. I'm heartbroken. What was wrong? Nothing wrong with the hook. Nope. Just tossed it. Oh man. I'm shaking a little bit. <laughs> that was a big one, man. That was that was probably the, one of one of the bigger salmon I've ever had on before. Really? Yeah. Whew. Okay, uh, I need a drink. <laughs> take a quick, take a breather and get back in there. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm like literally shaking, man. <laughs> Dang, that was a crazy fish, guys. I can't believe I lost him. All right, quick update, guys. Caught one jack. Nate caught one jack. Um, I had a huge fish on and it popped off like two feet away from the net. So that was pretty painful. Um, I'm sticking with the spinner type thing, so I got the, the blue fox there. I don't know if you can see that. And it seems to be getting us the most bites, but we're gonna continue fishing here. The fish are just seem to be filtering in slowly, like they just go up and down. We see them jumping, less so lately, but we're gonna try to keep going. Gonna try to catch another big one. So stick with us as we continue our salmon journey. We are done at this at this particular river. It's pretty late in the day. We're actually just gonna take a couple minutes and try one river on the way back. We caught one or two jacks, and I had that one monster on, which I hope that footage turns out. I wanna see that fish jump. Me too, I wanna see it too. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, we're gonna hit another river nearby on the way home and see if we can't pull up one more fish or maybe two more fish or something in, in a couple minutes. And then it's actually kinda late. I have a long drive, so that's gonna be fun. I'm gonna pick up some coffee and probably call a wife on the way home or something <laughs> anyway guys i'll see you at the next river and hopefully we can show you some more fish oh wow cool. Look at big cool. let's put it cool. put it in front of him oh my god yeah, there's dude. so many yeah. fish i told you Come on, I'm putting it right in front of them. Damn, there's so many. <laughs> They're all in there. That was crazy. They just kept coming. There's a whole line of them. Oh, man down. You okay? At least we're at the last spot of the day, man. I saw I saw him go completely sideways. I think I got the I got the end result, yeah. <laughs> you went you went fully in, man. Your head was just about the only thing that didn't go under. <laughs> oh they're all right here, man. They all just like 20 or 20 of them just passed right in front of me. There's like 50 fish swimming around within like this tiny little stretch of river. And so we've been like frantically casting with absolutely no luck somehow. Spinners, twitch and jigs. I'm about to go get my other rod and throw some bait in here. They just seem to be super lockjaw, but it's really cool to see them swimming around like crazy. Yeah. <laughs> YouTubers are all dirty. <laughs> Dirt on them. All right, guys, we tried our best at that last spot. We saw, like, I swear to God, we probably saw, like, 60 salmon. It was nuts. Yeah. But they were all kind of dark and old, and they were lockjaw. Like, they didn't even, 
they were spooked from everything we threw at them. That's how that's how much they were not interested in anything. But it was cool to see them. Like it was great, and I like that type of river. Those little smaller rivers like that. They're, those are my favorite to, to walk around. It's a BMW, I'm, I'm so this. it's a BMW. <laughs> Donnie's having some uh, some road road uh, driver issues. Ruby. Yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, I did want to say thanks again to Nate Pluff. Uh, I'll put his information in the description. It's right here. He is the guide. If you are interested in salmon or steelhead fishing up in the Quinault Reservation, definitely check him out. I'll leave his information either on the screen here or, or and definitely in the, in the description below. So if you are interested, give him a call or an email, and he can help you get on some fish for sure. Overall, it was a great day. I mean, I caught a nice chrome bright salmon even though it was a little small and I hooked into a giant one so that was fun thanks for watching guys peace out guys peace out until next time keep fishing keep foraging say goodbye guys see you later later all right peace <laughs>